Hey, Fight fans, it's Michelle Joy Phelps, and I'm joined now with the Commonwealth Heavyweight Champion, Lenroy Thomas. How are you? I'm doing good. good. What about yourself? I'm great, thank you. Um, first of all, let's talk about you're here in Sheffield, freezing. Did you expect it to be like this? Listen, TNT is here, so I brought the storm with me. <laughs> it's definitely something I wasn't expecting. It's a little too cold for my liking. Anyways, you have a big rematch coming up. First, wanted to ask you, is there real bad blood between you and Dave Allen, or is it just sort of, you know, typical fight words between uh, two fighters? He have the words. Mm -hmm. I'm me. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't let the hype, what he said, get in my head. Mm -hmm. I just be me. That's mm -hmm. it, you know? That's it? That's it. What? He's doing the talking for me. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. You know. Now, he says that he wasn't prepared then. What do well, you make of him saying that, that he wasn't, I guess he sort of slacked off a bit during training camp, and he wrote that off as the excuse for why he lost? Listen, that fight, he told me he was prepared. For the Luis Ortiz fight, he said he wasn't prepared. So, we know what happens. And it's the same thing going to happen again. I'm going to leave here two times, heavyweight, come in heavyweight champ of the world. Mm -hmm. Nothing more. You plan on retiring him then? That's the plan. I know Eddie Hearn said that if he does not win, this is it. It's game over for him. This is my moment. Yep. This is my time. I know this is his hometown, but got nothing to do with me. I have my faith. I believe in the most high. And uh, the battle is his, not mine. That's yep. it. Kenny Porter is your trainer. Let's talk a bit about that. Okay. Having a good old Kenny in your corner. And also Sean, you know, having Sean in your life as well. Tell me a bit about that. Um, How did that come about? It's funny. We, we connect here in the last fight. And um, it's been a blessing. He's not just my trainer. He's like a life coach. Um, filling in that gap where my dad wasn't there. You know, just the little things that you thought I would know, he, he's corrected. You know, and, and, and that's the process part of it. Heck of a trainer. I love what he does, how he pushed me physically, mentally. But he's also preparing me for life. Mm -hmm. See, fighting the ring, it's okay, but the real fight is life. Hold a hand of business, stuff like that. And that's what he's, he's getting me ready for. And he's always with that wisdom. Yes, he is. <laughs> I get it every day. He moved me in his home. I mean, he's, uh, he's like a drill sergeant, mm -hmm. and I love it. You know? The heavyweight division is booming at the moment, as you know. I mean, we got a big fight this weekend. We got Deontay Wilder versus Luis Ortiz. Man, those, those, I was just in camp with, uh, with, with Deontay. Mm -hmm. um, I know Ortiz personally. Man, the heavyweight division is You torn? Awesome. Listen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to sit back with my popcorn, you know what I'm saying? I know I know who's going to win, no disrespect to nobody, man, but uh, Deontay doing his thing, and I know Deontay want uh, AJ, mm -hmm. AJ want him, so it, it has to happen, yeah. you know? Who wins that, though? Wilder or Joshua? That's a million-dollar question everyone has right now. We all have to see. Oh, come on now, come on now, you know. We all have to see, we all have to see. Um, but it, it's going to be epic. You know, I, I got to roll with my man. I got to roll with my man, Deontay. Boom, squad. I, I got to roll with my man. Yeah. He's got so much energy, too, in camp, right? Because I know Deontay. And he's, he, he's a good dude, yeah. man. All these guys have been in camp with, you know, been in camp with Ortiz, Pavikin, Deontay, Malik Scott. The list goes on, man. They're all top guys, and I have mad love and respect for them. You know? Well, look, Lenore, I wish you nothing but the best because I know Thank that, you. you know, an another win for you just moves you in the, in the direction, yeah, up the ladder, with, even with these guys. That's it. What would you like fight fans to know? Like, final words. Listen, man, it doesn't, it's not how you start. It's how you finish. Mm -hmm. um, just believe in yourself. Believe in the most high. Keep pushing yourself. And just stay the coast. Enjoy the moment. Mm -hmm. Embrace the pressure. You will get there. Just don't give up. Don't let nobody talk you to your dreams and go. Because if I would have listened to people years ago, I wouldn't be here in this position, living this moment right now. Wow. Enjoy it. Deep. One day at a time, man. That's true. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Thank you so much. All right. Bye, Fight Fans. Hey, Fight Fans. It's Michelle Joy Phelps. If you haven't already subscribed to our YouTube channel, make sure you do so by clicking this icon right here or else.